Get your sea legs on. We're in search of some 50-ton friends in Panama. First day in Panama, Every year, humpback whales migrate 6,000 miles from Antarctica to Panama's warm, shallow waters to birth their young. In the summer, you have a great chance of seeing mamas and their babies playing just off the boat. The gentle giants love to say hello in their own way. Our guide is American Ann Gordon de Barragon, owner of Whale Watching Panama, who fills us in on the size of these giants of the deep. They're about equivalent to the size of a city bus. If we don't see them, we can hear them. Somewhere close by, there's a boy band of males. Song, it's a true song. If you break it down into the elements of a song, it's a true song. And it lasts about 20 to 30 minutes, the song. And all the whales in the same area sing the exact same song. Panama sing one song, but the whales in Australia or Hawaii, humpback whales, sing a different song. Oh my gosh. And each year the song changes. And we have no idea why. Well, yeah, there's no, there's, there's no reason. Well, there's a reason, we just don't know. We just right. <laughs> <laughs> As we head back into Panama City, hundreds of playful spotted dolphins surround our boat, racing us back home. These guys really know how to steal the show. Not bad for our first day. Tomorrow, we head into the jungle to spend the day with the Embera tribe. You won't want to miss it.